aerial footage of the moment 14 activists were caught on the island of Dioyutai and removed by the Japanese Coast Guard. It's the first time non-Japanese nationals have landed on the disputed island since 2004, and Japan now looks set to deport these protesters, who were from China, Hong Kong and Macau, who took the daring step to sail out to the island earlier this week. They're all now in custody, while their fate is decided, and the spat between Japan and China over its ownership continues. Japan calls the islets, which are between Taiwan and Okinawa, as the Senkaku Islands. China calls them the Daoyu Islands. They've been a source of tensions because they hold value for both countries, the potentially rich gas and oil deposits there, and their healthy fishing waters. China has maintained that it has indisputable sovereignty over the islands and has urged the safe release of all 14 activists. Angry protests outside the Japanese embassy in Beijing is pressuring officials for a swift and diplomatic resolution to the issue. The US has urged both countries to set aside their differences and says it won't intervene.